Reaction of hemagglutination. Hemagglutination serves as convenient method for detection and assay the, of the influenza virus. For this reaction, we uh, use test tubes or special plastic trays. We add 0.9% of physiological solution and uh, add in all test holes. After them, we dilute the virus consistent material. Uh, original concentration of virus consistent material 1 to 5 and we start to dilute it and uh, each new dilution in, uh, in half and first tube in 1 to 10, 1 to 20, 1 to 40, 1 to 80, 1 to 160, 1 to 320 and excluded the RBC control. After them, we add red blood cells uh, in serial dilution of viral suspension. And we try to detect the highest dilution that produce hemagglutination, provides the hemagglutination titer. Red cells, which are not agglutinated, settle at the bottom in the form of a button, while the agglutination cells are seen and spread uh, into the uh, shield-like pattern. This one. In Russian literature, you can see the definition as umbrella. This is button shape. The mechanism of this reaction is dependent of the structure of uh, influenza virus. Influenza virus uh, consists the hemagglutinin spice, spikes on the surface of the virus. The influenza virus also carries on its surface a, an other peplomer, the enzyme neuraminidase, which acts on the receptor and destroy it. Neuraminidase is therefore called, called the receptor destroying enzyme. RDE is produced by many bacteria, including Vibrio cholera, and also present in many vertebral cells. Destruction of receptors leads to the, uh, to the reversal of the hemagglutination and the release of the virus from the uh, red cell surface. This is known as elution.